All right, what's up everyone? Welcome back to another video. So I'm currently at the parking lot of the gym. Currently three weeks out. Today is actually the last day of my third week of this prep. Um, so the, at the beginning of this week, apparently I was weighing under my stage weight. Woke up weighing around 136 and I want to weigh at 140 on stage right so currently under my stage weight so what I've been doing lately this past few days is you know just upping my calories intakes and having having a little bit higher carbs but other than that, um, my training sessions are, some days are kind of shitty, and excuse my language, but are kind of shitty some day. So I've been coming in twice. Other than that, um, I'm actually really excited about this competition now compared to the eighth week of this prep. I was feeling really nervous then, but now it's more of like a I can't wait kind of thing now. So muscle striations are coming in. I'm not feeling really shredded. Definitely feeling flat. But that's actually how you're supposed to be feeling during prep. Um, but. And an interesting thing that I learned during this th during this prep was, even though I'm feeling really flat, I'm actually still making gains. You know, I can actually still see that. Oh, yeah, I'm putting on more muscles each ta uh, each day that I come in here. So that's a good thing. But with that being said, I'm gonna show you guys a full arm workout. And you know, just gotta get guide you guys through this workout. So just follow follow along, and um, yeah, just enjoy this video. Try for yourself and see how it works for you. Um, I'll show you guys some of my favorite arm exercise that I've been doing that has been you know improving my my biceps and my arms triceps as well. So yeah, just follow along and hope you guys enjoy this video. Same old sound. I wonder if it fades away. Haunting me now. All the things I heard you say. But I know in the end you'll wish to take it back. Oh 
right guys so that is it for this video hope you guys really enjoyed it um i know that there was not a lot of clips and it was a really short video i was not expecting it to be this actually you no know, short but because my phone's about to die right now i really want to cut this short so i can just finish off this video before it, my phone's dead <laughs> and i'm home already but before I end off this video, I just want to talk about one thing. The fitness industry is such a cruel thing. You know, as good as you, as good as it is, you know, because you're bettering off, you're just bettering, bettering off yourself, you know, getting better. There's always someone out there who will you know just try to discourage you and put you down and you know, I just think that it's such a crucial thing you know like honestly like I just don't think that it's really necessary for for others to even try to put you down when they're they themselves are not even bettering themselves. You know, I'm sure that a lot of us who are in the fitness industry have at le have at least experienced, you know, people telling you that you know you're having too much time just because you're doing what you're doing, you know, like working out, and that's such. A bullshit, you know, and excuse my language, but I just think that that's bullshit, you know, like all those times that they spent scrolling through Instagram, your social media, and you know, talking shit, or all those times that they spend with their friends drinking, going out, you know, and getting and getting drunk and high. Those times could have been spent, you know, getting better and bettering themselves. You know, and I just, and don't get me wrong, right? I myself like to spend time with my friends and my family and having fun. But we have to also think about what's going to benefit us 10 years from now. And is is going out with your friends and getting drunk and high going to benefit you from 10 years from now? Think about it, right? Are those people really your friends? Because, here, listen, all right? So, I personal, personally think that friends don't really discourage each other or you know are always trying to get drunk and high off of alcohol and, and 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 whatever right don't get me wrong too you know we we like to have fun here and there but i just think that friends if they're really your friends they're going to push you to be better they they they're going to they're going to you know they won't discourage you, but motivate you and telling you that, you know, are all, and then they're going to always going to be there for you behind your back, supporting you with whatever you're doing, whether it's, whether it's, it's fitness, fitness wise or education or whatever you're doing, you know, and those people that are, are, are trying to, trying to get you influenced with those other kind of stuff that won't benefit you 10, 10 years from now. Those, those people are just going to be there for you now in the present. And don't get me wrong, right? You know, it's all about right now. And, but, you know, we, we got to think, think outside of the box, you know. Uh, are, are you, are you doing, are you happy with where you're at? And, you know, just, I just think it's, 
really stupid for those people who are you know scrolling through your Instagram page and scrolling through your, your progress and talking shit about you. Why when when they could have you know spent those time better in themselves, getting better. So what I'm trying to say here is. Don't let other people put put you down, because you know you're better than better than uh, bettering than them. Because you're doing something that, you know, is gonna benefit you, and you're getting better every day. While those people are talking shit behind their freaking phone, and all they're doing is just sitting, right, sitting there. But yeah, you know, I'm just getting heated right now. <laughs> but yeah. Hope you guys really enjoyed this video. That's all I wanted to talk about. But three weeks out, two weeks out. Super excited. I'll see you guys in the next video. Squeeze the G, lead the scene. Bouncing like the trampoline. Getting bread, earning.